Hello, I am the Ronin Pawn, and this is XCOM Long War Pawns War! Whoa, welcome back, everyone! Uh, so what are we doing today? Well, we've got 80 quid, um, in the bank. We've got 80 quid, and we, we do, you know what? Here's the thing. Last mission, we got King Komodo in a bad way. We did, we, we hurt him. We got him injured, and he's gonna be down for a month. But when he comes back, I want to be able to give him a gift, and that is the gift of the auto laser. So, there you go. I'm gonna have that for you. Um, when you get back to work, King Komodo, I've got new weapons for you to carry, okay? That's my gift to you. That's my gift to you, and my massive apology for getting you injured. Okay, it's a small scout, low over Germany. Low. It's not nape of the earth, it's low. See, if I think that this will land, I would love to just let it land and, um, and then, you know, come and, come and raid it once it's down there, but I don't know that it's going to land because it's low and not nape of the earth. So, let's scramble an interceptor. Uh, let's send out... Bucky Chenwoo needs to get herself a kill. I've decided that Bucky Chenwoo is, is a woman. It just makes sense to me. Uh, I don't know if it makes sense to you. Uh, Bucky, Bucky, you know. Enemy Ooh. Is padlocked. Ooh, the, the globe looks prettier now. Okay, Approaching okay, ready? Ready, now. everyone? Here's a new feature of Long War um, Beta 14. When you get them down to half health, they start doing that. Do you see that? Do you see that? It started, okay, uh, let's go back and I'll give you another shot, shot at it. Uh, in case you missed it the first time, I'll show you what's going on. <laughs> when you get the enemy down to half health, it starts to sort of plume the explodey thingies all over. Eyes on, the eyes on the bandit. Don't take any damage because then we'll be out of, uh, out of planes for quite a while. Oh, ow, you took damage. You took that, you gotta hit him. You gotta hit him once. Hit him once, he's almost down. Jesus, that was quick. Jesus, that was quick! That contact was lost immediately! That's not... I don't like that. Now we don't have anyone to send! And we won't have anyone back for two days! Not over this content, continent, anyway. Alright, fine then. Carry on. Carry on. Come on, Jacob Orth. Back to duty for you. Non-momentous. Get back in there. Uh, the only Bruce not coming back is... It's okay, I bought you an auto laser. I bought you an... You want more sectoid corpses? You know, eventually I do have to research these sectoid corpses. Eventually. Uh, for now, I will take your scientists. Thank you very much. Yes! Advanced beam lasers research project complete! Holy poo! You guys got what you wanted. You got what you wanted. You wanted more beam lasers? Well, now we've got... The scatter laser. The laser strike rifle. The laser sniper rifle. The super heavy laser. The laser cannon. And the... Awkward laser. For when you pause awkwardly. Okay. Uh, what else? Are we what's what are we researching next? Uh, alien materials, experimental warfare, xenogenetics. We can't do the alien communities because we don't have enough computers. We can't do the muton op uh, autopsies because we don't have enough mutons. We could do sectoid or thin man autopsy. I'm gonna say thin man autopsy would be excellent. It would also be nice to get um, uh, new armor in, but new armor costs money, and we've been having a bit of trouble in the money department lately. So let's get the thin man autopsy out of the way, because that is going the to give us the... Oh, God. Until this point, going to give us the option to upgrade our to med kits. The thin man. The thin man. Initial testing has revealed a concerted effort by the oh. aliens to oh, God. modify this specimen's oh, somebody structure. Somebody get a bucket. Somebody get a bucket. To make it it's it's leaking human. all over the place. However, Oh, Jesus. inspection, we seem to have had some trouble concealing the eyes, which appear to be the reptilian eyes? in nature. Reptilian eyes. Reptilian eyes. I've got, I've got, uh, double vision. I've got double vision. Thin Man Autopsy lined up. Let's continue just blaring away Command. toward our next abduction site in Sapporo, Japan. Sapporo, Sapporo, Nippon. Nippon. Yes. Oh, I am loving that I can just, boom, instantly go in there and start choosing my loadout. I don't have to faff around. Look at all the people who came back! Oh, that's great. There's just a few of you who just need a few more hours, and you'll be back on duty. All right. We've got our whole staff up. It's another light mission. Let's take some assaults. Let's take... Let's take Josh Cusworth. Shall we take Josh Cusworth? He, he's pretty good for an assault, let me tell you. Um, it is a light mission. We should look for another rookie that we could bring up. Who's the rookie of the day? We've got F Kid Spur. F Kid Spur's got a 63, but you've also got a 3 health. And I don't like that. I would actually be willing to take someone with a lower aim who has a better not getting killed ratio. So I'm thinking of taking Immortal Dragon because 5 health 
and 14 move, and the 61 aim, it's a low, 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 low aim. But those are good stats otherwise. Uh, I think I'm going to do that. Welcome to the team, Immortal Dragon. That's the only rookie that we're going to take, because we need some more mo rookies. Hey, we need some more rookies. That means we get to name some more rookies. That's a good idea. That's a good idea, Pawn. Let's take the, um, the Jacob Orth 1, 2, 3 for our scout, because we are going to need a scout, and uh, I'd like to upgrade our Lance Corporals as much as I can at this point. Let's also take Jasus as a Rocketeer, because he's on the verge of becoming Corporal. We need to move everyone up to Corporal now, including, including, just Steven, just Steven, Roadway. Oh, yes, Roadways are perfect for snipers. You can just hunker them down and kill everything in front of you. How about one of our engineers? How about... Uh, T. Runaway, you've already gotten some 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 attention. Pure Diamond's gotten some attention recently, but not too recently. I think uh, I think we need a medic, right? Did I pick a medic yet? No, we didn't. So I need a medic. Who's the medic coming along? Uh, Lance Corporal, DK Little, or Custard Man? Uh, Cussworth Jordan. DK Little's already come with us today, hasn't he? Any? Or was it you? Who who didn't come? Who hasn't been? Who didn't with for the two of the stuff and the guys and the things? I can't remember. I'm, br I'm bringing Cuss with Jordan, because, you know, he's my mate. He's my mate! Um, so, scope for you? Why would I give you a scope? Absolutely not. No scopes for you, sir. You can take lots and lots of grenades. In fact, why don't you have both of those kinds of grenades? Uh, actually, take a flashbang and a high explosive. Those are very useful for an assault to have on them. Destroy cover, um, keep people from killing you while you're on the front lines, that sort of a thing. So you're going to need the assault carbine. Our laser weapons still aren't in. Damn it. Um, they're coming. They're coming. Give it time, Pawn. I will. I'm fine. That's okay. So five and one on your health. That's fine. I'm going to leave you in that vest. Ooh, no. No. There's no need to leave you in that vest because you've got great move. So put on some armor. Uh, better check on you as well. It's six and you've got horrible moves. So Josh Cussworth, you just got to stick and move, son. Stick and move. Avoid those bullets as best you can. You're going to be taking the rifle, absolutely. You're going to need a scope. Um, for the scout, we've decided scouts shouldn't have flashbangs. doesn't make sense. Uh, so why don't you carry uh, Why don't you carry what you should be carrying, which is the battle scanner, okay? You need to replace your testicle... What's she going to replace? Mammary glands. Okay, just, just move on, Pawn. Just move on. These jokes aren't funny. You're not funny anymore. Give up on it. Just try and be the guy who, you know, the... the umpteenth millionth uh, YouTuber who just, just explains everything. Okay, uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a scope on her for the increased aim as well as the assault rifle because she's got... Yeah, no, that's not true. That's, let's do something different than that. I'm, I'm actually not a big fan of that. Rocketeer, you're all set. Um, just Steven. Just Steven. Grab a scope. Sniper rifle. You got a laser sight. You got a pistol. I wish you'd had a la laser pistol on you. Your health is very low, but your move is also very low, so you're just gonna have to stay in the back and, 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 and stay in the back. And also, if you could just stay in the back. And, uh, when we ride the bus, just stay in the back. It's a good idea for you. Okay, everyone's loaded out. What have we got with us? We've got the med kits. Wait a second, have you got smoke? No, you haven't got smoke. Uh, so you've got um, covering fire, though. So you've got the med kits, you've got the nothing, you've got the boom boom, you've got the battle scanner, you've got a boomy, you've got some boomy and some flashy bangy. We don't have any smoke. That's fine. We won't need smoke this mission. <sighs> We're so gonna need smoke this mission. That's gonna be the only thing that we need of all the things that we could have needed is gonna be like, if only we had smoke! If only the Ronin port had brought in smoke! Yeah. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Slumrock says I should have put a, a scope on the assault. Well, screw you, Slumrock! No, no. Slumrocks is new to the channel. Welcome, Slumrocks. And when we get a rook when we get a new batch of rookies in, I've got lots of people to name actually. But but if you stick around, then I will name a rookie after you, sir. Thank you for coming. Thank you for joining us. Well, let's send the assault forward first, because you happen to be right on the front lines there. So Josh Cusworth, move up there. Who's who's? Where's my scout? I'm sure I brought a scout. Where's the scout? No. Where are you? Is it not you? It's, there you go, Jacob Orth, one, two, three, not only you and me, okay. got 180 degrees, and I'm caught in between singing. Um, it's, don't, don't, don't listen to that music. Okay, medic, medic, sure, why not. Uh, rookie, 
Rookie, what are you thinking? What are you thinking? What's in your little, pretty little head today? Why don't you just move up here? Just move up there. We're safe. We're fine. Nothing's going to happen at all. There you go. Both rookies right there. And the, uh, the sniper. Sniper, you can just stay where you are. And, uh, that's not going to help us anyway, whether you do or not. So, just move okay. up there. And, oh, that's the Rocketeer! Where's my sniper? Who was the sniper? I must have moved the sniper when I thought I was moving something else. Where's my sniper? There's my sniper, just Steven. Sorry, just Steven, didn't mean to put you there. Oops, oops, uh, oops, oops. Here, why don't we, as long as we're moving people where we shouldn't, then let's do that. And let's also bring the medic up. No, the medic stays there. <laughs> we have some semblance of, of, you know, caution to you, Paul. That would be a good idea, these people. Oh my god, cool James Kerman just put a frickin' paragraph of text into chat. Good lord, what's going on? Are you argu- are people arguing? Okay. That's the only time you see big paragraphs in, in chat is when people are screaming at each other, you know, trying to decide who was the best to Boba Fett or something. I don't know what, what the kids talk about today. So we'll do Burt Backrack, Hula Hoop, and all that sort of thing. Um, but that's the only time you see a lot- you, you, don't argue, people. Don't argue, kids. Okay, I will turn this thing around. I will turn this thing around. I will take the, uh... We'll take the plane and all of all the rookies right back to where we started from. <laughs> you guys don't stop arguing. I will, I will I reach back there and, uh... <laughs> Sniper, you're going to be blocked at a lot of shots unless you, um... Because there's lots of full cover all over the place. Come over here. You should be able to see a lot of things for the next turn from there. And... Another string of overwatches just moving up. We see that there's Meld ahead. That was the sound of inevitability, Mr. Anderson. No? No one? Nothing? No one? More floaters! More floaters in our future. More floaters for the run and pawn. Who's this? This is the scout, so the scout can absolutely, that's definitely permanent. move that's forward. For. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. You know what else we're looking for? Is the aliens. Where are they? Are they all going to be in one spot? We're going to be tri triggering like three pods at once on this map. Is that what you're telling me? Who's this? Immortal dragon? You're a rookie and you're going to take the, the front line? Yeah, it sounds like a good idea. That's where you want to keep your rookies. I mean, if you don't, then you're okay. wasting them. Medic to there, and Jasus. Jasus, our rocketeer. Our rocket just fall man. there. Apparently, we're still not anywhere near the evil bastards that we're going to be killing later. So, everyone's very, very nice and safe. Who's that? Who is that? Bring me back to this person. There you are. Uh, Josh Cusworth, the other rookie. Oh, you're not a rookie anymore. You're the assault. You definitely need to be leading... The Assault, then. That's why we call you Assault, because you're gonna lead it. And another Overwatch? Should, should we really do another Overwatch? I mean, jeez. Jeez, we've gotta to get to that meld sooner or later, people. Sometimes you gotta run for meld, you know? It's just the way it, it's just the way it is. It's just the way it is. And things will never be the same. That's just the way it is. Ah. Okay. Come on. A couple of people up there. Apparently they're gonna be down in that, down in the valley where the veins don't grow and the tied up tie. Can I do more references this episode, do you think? Can I do more song references? Wow, yeah, we're not seeing anything. Everybody move up. Everybody run for meld. Run for meld. Yeah, medic, just stand out there with you just flapping in the breeze. That's a good idea for you. That makes a lot of sense. Really good. Really good. And the sniper, sniper. Yeah, sure. Move everybody. Let's all double move. There you go. Everybody double moved. Have no overwatches. And here come the squids. Oh, no. They, they haven't triggered yet. Oh, now they're triggered. Now they're triggered. They, the universe was listening. Oh, they haven't triggered yet. And then immediately they trigger. Um, sniper, what do you think? Too close? Too close. Too close for you. How about you? Too close? No, not close enough for you. <laughs> How are we going to do this? Who's got the good aim? Who's going to do the shootings of the things? Well, nobody is. Nobody is straight off. So, yeah, let's move you up here. And somebody's got battle scanners, too. We should probably throw some of those down into the, into the crevasse below. That'd be a good idea. Uh, that's gonna be you, Jacob Orth, actually. Jacob Orth's going to have the battle scanner, so let's put you way off and away out by your... No, okay. put you right there. Put you right there, and go ahead and chuck a battle scanner somewhere. Somewhere's, say, say down here. That's a good place. What do we see, Jacob? What do you got? Pull it up on your cell phone. Okay, well, we found the other one. Maybe we can get the Rocketeer to send a rocket down, down in there. And, uh, and hurt some people. You've already moved Rocketeers, so that's gonna be uh, an issue. But let's see what we could do, potentially. Just, you know, speaking from a potential sort of... There you go. Friendly fire! Who's... Who, where, where's... What friendly fire? Who's down there? 
What, what are you talking about? Front, oh, because I'm going to kill the meld. I'm going to destroy the meld if I take the shot. I see what you're doing there. Yeah, we never we never really get meld anyway. I'll probably end up destroying the meld if I take any shots with you, so... That's a good thing to not do. That's one of those good things to not be doing. Thank you for warning me. Uh, I'm going to move out. you over here. Who are you? Oh, Josh Cusworth! Josh Cusworth with the shotgun! Yes, that'd be, uh, you should be very, very, very close. Very close to the front line, in, in half cover, right where they can kill you move. very easily. That's where you want to be, Josh. Now, I want to keep Josh alive. He's a really good, really good, um, everything. Take that shot, Josh. Kill that thing. Beautiful! See? What was I saying? What was I saying about the Cusworth tribe? They're beautiful human beings. Every one of them. Every single one of them. Uh, sniper, you just you, you, lone wolf. Remember, lone wolf. So stand back here. Steady your weapon for the next thing. And this fella is going to have a lot of Overwatches to run. I feel, Commander. Come on up, come on up. Three Overwatches. How you doing? You're you're dodging all of them. Impressive. Impressive squid. That is an impressive squid who's now going to, yeah, with the Josh Cusworth in the face. Well, see, now, you probably shouldn't have done that because Josh Cusworth, he gets very angry. He gets very angry when people do those sorts of things to him, and he happens to carry a shotgun. So, he probably should have uh, thought twice about doing that to Josh Cusworth. That's all I'm saying. Also, um, one of his lover, um, just Steven, gets really pissed, and he carries a sniper rifle. So, yeah. You see, you really, you're just pissing everybody off today, Squid. You probably should have thought twice. Before uh, before doing that, I'm just I'm just suggesting to you would have been a good idea. In fact, you know what? Okay. I probably shouldn't be letting this out of the bag, but every now and then, uh, the two of them uh, that's uh, the two of them will invite Jasus twelve thirty three to the bedroom. So she's probably not too pleased with you either. Yeah. No yeah. See. See. And then the uh, this person is just going to come and eat your corpse. <laughs> I don't know, I kind of pushed the joke there, didn't I? I pushed a little too far. Welcome. Medic, come up to here. I don't want you too far forward. I don't want you ahead of everybody else. But I will send Jacob Orth ahead of everyone else if it means that we can get that meld. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? Look at where the meld... It's randomized meld locations now uh, with Long War. Look at where the meld showed up. There's no cover provided by the meld anywhere. They're cooking the meld. And I don't know if I come here if I'll be able to claim the meld or not. I'm going to find out right now because I'm not going down there. Hopefully I won't trigger anything. I didn't. We got the meld! That is a really weird meld location. You'll never see that location in uh, Enemy Unknown or Enemy Within. That is a Long War meld location. Thank you. Thank you very much. Who's this? Immortal Dragon. Are you really immortal? We're gonna find out on this mission. Uh, where are you coming to then? Where are you coming? Come to here and just stand there with the scout, ready, ready to get yourself killed, along with the scout, along with everyone. Overwatch is... Okay, we got some floaters ahead, and two more things of meld ahead as well. My goodness, we might collect a crap ton of meld here today, especially if we can kill the next batch of floaters. So we need to send, uh, we need to send Jake Borth down. She can't get there because a mortal dragon's standing in the way. Mortal dragon, piss off. Piss off, stand up here. You're all over nothing. Holy crap! Hello! It's a couple of sectoids hiding on us. That's not good. That's... Yeah, watch all of the things. Uh, can I get like some of that in there? That would be a good thing to get in there. Yeah, let's do let's do one of these. Except for let's get you out of there first, medic. Let's move you away. I think we can kill all of them in this round. Is a thing. I th like I don't know where we would fall to if we couldn't. Like where is cover against these guys? Really, that doesn't count as cover apparently. See, no cover benefit from that. So yeah, there's there's. We've got to kill them all. Get We've got done. to kill them all in this round. So you fall back here, and then uh, uh, to throw that in. I mean, can I move you any? Oh, yes, yes, okay, you can come around here. We do have some cover. So come around okay. to here, and then let's also move the rockets here. Oh, we could send a rocket. That's even better. Send a rocket no in there. Twice. No need to ask twice. No need to ask twice, no. Let's try the, um, let's try doing this. Let's try doing, let's not do that. Let's use the grenade. Rocketeers are notoriously unpredictable, uh, whereas Grenadiers, uh, very predictable. Incredibly predictable. Just, just gonna throw that right there. Exactly right there. Oh, no, you, you threw it off. Oh, that's not gonna hit. You missed. No, that's fine. Oh, you're kidding me. It didn't destroy any cover. What are those, permanent cars? Those are those permanent cars I've been hearing about. 
Uh, you need to pull back, fall out of there somewhere, probably, because I do want to shove a rocket up their butts now. I really would like to. <sighs> You've got a great shot on him, though. Stay there. Stay there, and we'll see if we can't get this done with everyone else. Medic, you got a 60 on that fella. Take it. And it's a kill. Kill for the medic. Excellent. Excellent. Good work. Good work, sir. Excellent work. Um, if we're not going to send a rocket up his butt, then <laughs> what am I going to do? What would be the idea then? Because uh, there's not a, there's not any more cover. I'd have to fall back, and you can't even see him from where you are now. I don't like that. I don't like that. I want to kill. How many how many shots have we got left? A lot. We got a sniper too that I'm ignoring. Sniper, try your 50/50. Okay, good shot. Good shot. I give you credit for that. And that means that we're gonna fall in and just end end this fella. We don't even need to worry about rockets. Screw it. Just run up there, get in his face, get up in his face like the Resurrection, and put a 70% shot down his throat. There you go. Oh, I forgot you've got hollow targeting. I should be using that. Thoughtfully. In a way that makes sense. You've got a great shot downward on this fella, so take that one. Immortal Dragon. He is not an Immortal Dragon. No, he's a dead dragon. He's a very, very dead dragon. Rocketeer, move up here. Rocketeer, move up here. That's two pods we've killed. All of them are dead, and now we've fallen on the floater. That didn't rhyme at all. Sorry. Sorry, everyone. Didn't rhyme. My bad. Uh, scout. Scout to half cover. And what's your deal? Josh Cussworth. No, these guys have got to fall down. You've got to fall down, fall in. We're going to be crossing these these fjords very shortly. So there's the... There's the you. And, ooh, my god, Immortal Dragon, you've got quite the run on you, haven't you? you Move over there, that corner. Who else? Who else? Who's coming up? Who's coming up? Ba, ba, who's coming up? You're coming, you're coming up. Uh, uh. And since you're a sniper, you're going to be able to shoot from miles away. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's perfect. It's just it. as I want. Move you move up. We need to do some reloads. Reloads would be good. Uh, but not with you. Not with you. You just, you just go ahead and run up there. And everyone else is going to overwatch as soon as we get there. Wow, I can overwatch before she gets there. Cool. Oh, we found more meld. There's more meld ahead, everyone. Maybe we can run for some meld. That'd be, that'd be that. No. Hear what? What are you talking about? Michael, Michael Jackson? Yeah, I hear that. I hear that song playing. Oh, we've got to heal you, Josh Cusworth. We've got to get the medic up to you and try and do some healsies on, on, on the Josh Cusworths. Um, yeah, it's kind of risky. It's kind of risky. I'll tell you what. I'm going to move you okay. over here. Mr. Cussworth, and then I think the medic will be able to get to right next to you. I'm behind full cover. Yes! I'm sorry, Cussworth. I wasn't paying attention, Josh, but I'm not going to get you killed. Not today. Because we're going to heal you. Heal it up. We'll be back in the fight ASAP. Get back in there. Do your thing, Josh. Do your thing. Whip it out on them. Show them, show them who's boss. Who is the boss? Aye, aye, is it Samantha or was it Tony? I forget. I forget. It's been a while since I watched that series. Uh, you up to there. We'll come up from two sides, apparently. Uh, yeah, you're just staying there forever there, just Steven. In fact, wait, because we might trigger something, so... Just don't, don't, don't take that quite yet. Uh, do we make the run with this fella? Run's gotta be made sooner or later. Not this round, though. Reload you. Let's have some reloads before we go anywhere. Jasus, reload. Um... Is, uh, you can reload as well. You're behind full cover. Everyone else is in Overwatch. Here they come, into our overwatch. Oh my god, was that a kill? Was that a kill from the scout? Six damage. No, you're still alive. Just barely. Barely breathing. Oh, and there's an overwatch up there that we're gonna have to break. Is that right? Is that true? This is gonna be difficult to get up there. I can't see any of them either, so here's what I'm gonna do. Here's the plan. Send Jacob Orth, the scout, up as close as we can get him. Ah! Damn it! We need to be able to see them, and then I can move the sniper in. That's the idea. That's what I was going for, was that I could move the sniper in. So it looked like she had eyes when she was about here on the ramp. No. <laughs> Damn it. I'm going to be sending people up and then pulling them back, is, is what I'm going to be doing here. Uh, what about you? If you go up here, can you put eyes on them? No. No, and we're all in very highly vulnerable positions. Okay, uh, you're, you're all gonna have to find cover up here, is the thing. Get get out of the way, smoke. That's a big, angry I'm plume of smoke. Okay, lightning reflexes. You're not gonna hit him. You're not gonna hit him. You're not gonna hit him. Oh, Jesus, that was close. You're not gonna hit Jacob Orth. Her, him, it, they. 
Okay, uh, you up as well. You up as well, Immortal Dragon, because we want you to remain immortal. Yeah, move out. Now we can see both of them, which means this sniper can see both of them. That's what you're going for. So who wants to die today? Who's got more health? You've got the health. 70%! Come on, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Okay, well, you know, you might as well have missed there. That wasn't hugely helpful. But, you know, I'm, 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 not, I'm not complaining. That's I'm complaining a little bit, to be honest with you. You need to get a lot closer than that. Um, wow, if they come down, you're screwed, though, if I move you up there. So, nope, nope, not going to risk it. Not going to risk it, no, sir. No Neither am I going to risk it with the medic. You can reload. And, and Jasus, Jasus, can you get up to any cover up here? No, you cannot. So, what are you going to do with floaters? You're going to fall back now. to where you came from. I'm not going to risk it. I'm not going to... Oh, Christ, you're in a horrible position. They can shoot right down on you. Oh, well, that was... I said I wasn't going to risk it. Yes. But I'm in the riskiest position we could possibly have right now. Oh, no. Oh, no. Who did you hit? Oh, well, it was the one who was... Yeah, I, I saw that coming a mile away. But I couldn't see it coming a mile away until we were there. Sniper, we need to take vengeance on behalf of Jasus. Um, can you, can you do that for us? Just Steven. Just Steven. No, you can't. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks. It's good. Wonderful. You're, you're awesome. I love you. 41, 48. Overwatches? Yes. We do have an overwatch. Well, take your 48 then. Yeah, take your 48. Put it in on him. There you go. I need to be using my scout's hollow targeting. Did I not say? I'm pretty sure I did say. Can you get up there and get a kill, Josh Cussworth? With your, um... Oh, yes you can. No overwatch from this fella. Whole butt. Whole butt. You don't want to... Don't curse on my channel, Josh. That's not... You know, you, you need to at least ask me before you do that. And that's a kill for the Josh Cussworth. And that's the end of the mission. And that means we got all the meld, too. And all we had to do was sacrifice Jacob Orth. One, two, three. I'm sorry, Jacob. These things happen. These things will will happen. You're fine. You'll, you will be fine. I'm saying. You'll be okay. We're, we're gonna help you. Maybe. Hopefully. Um, Josh Cussworth, he's been promoted to a CCSer. Thank God, Josh Cussworth. Best, best assault I've ever had. And Immortal Dragon, you want to be either a gunner or a rocketeer. You've got great move and horrible aim. That makes you a gunner. <laughs> I'm not going to I'm not going to risk having a rocketeer with that, that bad of aim. Oh, Jasus. Oh, Jasus, what hath I done to you? I've gathered 22 meld. I'll tell you that. That's one of the things that I do. Jasus. Jasus, I'm sorry. How are you doing, Jasus? Where are you? 29 will. Not that bad for Lance Corporal. You didn't take such a massive hit. Like, look at Neuronix. Look at the condition I've got Neuronix in, Jasus. And thank, thank, thank Jasus for, for the condition that your condition is in. I hope you'll all join us next week <laughs> on twitch.tv slash Ronan at 9 p.m. Sunday. For more of whatever the hell this is, I am the Ronin Pawn. I'm very tired. Pawn out.